नमस्ते गाइस आशीष शेफ और नमस्ते टेक एंड वी हैव गॉट जी फाइव विद अस जी फाइव एंड जी फाइव प्लस एसेंशियली रन ऑन द सेम वर्जन ऑफ सॉफ्टवेयर एंड दे कम विद सेम सेट ऑफ फीचर्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट टिप्स एंड ट्रिक्स दैट अप्लाइज बोर्ड टू जी फाइव एंड जी फाइव प्लस लेट्स बिगिन On the home screen you will find a Modo app here which is right here. If you tap on this you get two things here. One is the action which is basically related with gestures and second is the display setting which I'll say as notification control the amount of things you can see on notification. Let's first begin with our actions. It's basically a set of gestures. Now you have got one button navigation which works with swiping on the fingerprint sensor. Then you have other things like chop twice for flashlight, twist for quick capture, swipe to shrink screen, pick up to stop ringing, flip to do not disturb. These are all very basic, but what is interesting is one button navigation. What it allows you to do is use swipe to go back and forth without using the virtual menu keys. So for example, you can see here that you have got swipe left to go back, swipe left for recent apps. You can start OK Google now with a short long press until you hear the vibration and all those stuff can be done. For example, if I press on this, it goes on the home screen. Have a look at this video which describes how it actually works. Second thing is the display part, which is more about what kind of notifications you see. So you can show all notifications or hide some of them or completely turn off if that's your privacy thing. You also have option to turn off vibration and you can block apps which should not at all show notification on this phone. The next thing we'll take a look at is the display part where you can change the display size. Now mind you, I have said display size, not fonts. So if you go to settings and then you go to display and then move to display size. Remember font size is different, display size is different. What display size, what essentially does it, amount of text or amount of things you can see on the phone, on your screen, it changes now since it's a high resolution phone your stacks could be a little smaller so if you want to increase you can do that way if you want to decrease you can do this way now remember this is not just for the fonts and it is applied on the whole phone so even when you browse something with the browser the chrome browser it will apply to that as well if you use photos app when you launch it for the first time, you will you will get two years of unlimited backup free. Now we've already configured it with our account, so you cannot see it. But when you do it for the first time, you will get to see it. So two years completely free for you. Now the camera app comes with a professional setting. When you tap on this, where you actually usually switch to video mode, you get tons of features. You get panorama and all those stuff of which there is one mode which is kind of professional mode now you can change the iso setting here you can change white balance you can change the length and everything can be actually changed it's for those who want to get a little more out of the camera these settings are available both of these phones come with a fingerprint sensor which is right here through which the one button navigation was working it can also be used to lock and unlock apps and we are coming with a separate video on that have a look at this video to find out how you can use this fingerprint sensor to lock and unlock apps. Those who use SD card should know that you can actually move your apps to SD card. But the process is a little bit different and we had to do a separate video for that. So you will have to actually format your SD card, merge it with your phone storage and then you can expand the storage and have apps working on that. You can always use it separately but if you want your apps on the SD card, you will have to format and merge it. We have a separate video, have a look at it. So guys, that was all about G5 Plus and G5 Tips and Tricks. Have a look at these two recommended videos as well. Do subscribe to our channel. We're coming with more videos and we're definitely coming up with a giveaway soon. So if you have watched till end, you have a pre-announcement here. Thanks for watching.